What's up, Pam? <clears throat> Alright, guys. Name's Jose. Vigil. I'm originally from Sacramento, California, Yuba City. Um, moved here to Port Angeles, Washington. Currently, I am going to be running a new head team of the Port Angeles Division of Washington for Worldwide Predator Hunters. Currently seeking a team to build a team currently right now. Uh, hey, Jay. Welcome. Come on in, brother. Hey there, Heather. Hey there, Kayla. How we doing? So, just want to introduce myself as a new guy for Port Angeles, Washington. Uh, hoping to seek out a team currently right now. Hey there, Mano. How we doing? What's up, buddy? How we doing? Sorry about yesterday. Good, good. I fell asleep, bro. I had a long eight days, bro. Well, that's no problem, buddy. Introduce yourself. Let everybody know who you are, what you're, you know, where you're from, and where you're going to be hunting from. So, uh, as Jay was saying, I'm here to introduce myself as the new guy for Port Angeles, Washington. Uh, gonna say again, uh, I'm currently seeking to build a team here. Uh, currently, it's just myself. Uh, um, we have an uh, active uh player that wants to join the team we're hoping to build this team as quick as possible um currently we have three different districts here in port angeles that we have to report to right now we have the column county sheriff's department we have the port angeles uh, police department then we also have the column bay to worry about the res so port angeles is a very diverse little city. You know, you have uh, the townsfolk that's connected to the res, reservation. So uh, this organization we know uh, can't extend onto a reservation. So most of our bus would have to be off reservation. Um, Hello, Tammy. Hey there, Tammy, how we doing? So, oh, what are we up to today, Jay? How is everything? Not much, buddy. Just, uh, same old, same old. Um, so, if anybody in his area would like to start hunting, uh, please message the page. Is, uh, we need more hunters over there in his area. Yes. Um. I've talked to several uh, members of the police department here, and they all agree that this will be the perfect area because we also get a lot of the tourists here. We are connected to the port. We are the main inside of the tourists that come in through uh, Washington. Port Angeles is the main site for the tourists to get off the ferry from Victoria, from England, and other parts of uh, the world. And they come through Port Angeles right here, our ferry, to make it to Seattle, to Spokane, to uh, wherever it is they need to go. But this is the main stop. So a lot of traffic comes through this small town. So uh, talking to these police officers here agree that having an organization like this here would be perfect due to the high traffic of tourists. No, we do not have nobody in Dallas yet. We're still uh, needing hunters in Dallas. Uh, we still need hunters everywhere. Um, so, like I said, if you guys are wanting to be a hunter in your state, um, feel free to message the page. I'm great, Tammy. Hello, Maryland. It's starting my day. <sighs> Oh, man, so I'm a little bit camera shy, guys. There might be times where I'll have a little lapse of silence. Uh, uh, morning, Marilyn. Hey, Jay, is your phone running faster than mine? <laughs> I think so. <laughs> Don't say that, bro. Oh, man. <clears throat> Over here gloating about an LG G5. <laughs> Uh, 
Um, we we do background checks, Tammy. I do background checks before we before we hire you or anything like that. We do background checks on everyone, so um, we just don't let just anyone join. Morning, Charlotte. Um, hey, Paula. Jay, did you see someone blew up where the firefighter volunteered? No, I didn't see that. I, mean, I have not seen that. If you can uh, get a hold of me about that, that would be fantastic because I have not seen that. Just want to actively repeat that. Uh, um... I may be wearing California gear, but I am in Washington. I am currently living in Port Angeles, Washington, seeking to build a team in Washington. <clears throat> I should have changed my shirt, bro. It could confuse a lot of viewers. <laughs> um. <coughs> yeah. Um. I'm glad that you're, you know, uh, coming aboard. Um, you guys will be seeing him more often here shortly. Um, you know, we'll be having some stings up that way where he's at. So, um, you know, just want to extend a uh, thank you to the organization for bringing me in and allowing me to dedicate myself to helping others rather than myself. You know, uh, want to say, you know, it was hard to join the military or try to get into the military. It was hard to try to believe to be a police officer. I tried to be a correctional officer, you know, anything that's dedicated to helping the public. I've tried it, you know, and here I am uh, being open to uh, joining this organization that not only helps uh, the public, but helps the children within the public. And this is something that I've really been wanting to do since I can't join these other corporations. <clears throat> Thank you, Paula. <clears throat> Thank you, Marilyn. Good to be here. I've known Jay for a year. You know, very good man here. And he's got something powerful and awesome here. And I'm proud to be a part of it. Sorry to hear that, Tammy. I'm sorry, Tammy. You know, this world, it, it amazes you at how corrupt it can be within your own family, too. Thank you, Stephanie. I think my phone is <coughs> catching up now, bro. There is quite yeah, a bit of lag good. there. I don't know what happened. <laughs> but we... Uh... I don't know, guys. It's just the world that we live in, I guess. Um, just to let you guys know, if you guys do support the movement that we do, please go over there and buy yourself a T-shirt. Um, uh, Trick Apparel, thanks to you guys um, for being our sponsor. Mm -hmm. Um they're our very first sponsor that we have. Um, Trick Apparel, I appreciate you. So make sure that you go over there and check out our t-shirts, our sweatshirts and all that. Thank you, Charlotte. That's what we're here for. Um... If you guys like to, you know, send fan mail or, you know, phones or um, tablets or gas cards or 
um, anything like that, you can message the page, and we got a P.O. box. Um, we got a P.O. box that you can send all your donations to, and we'll get to them. And these, do these donations will help us get to these locations and make these busts and uh, anything helps, any contribution helps, you know, with the organization. It's all going back, you know. Uh, this is an or organization dedicated to giving back to the community versus taking. Thank you, Joseph. I see my daughter's typing in here. Is she? Where? On my wife's name. Oh, Jennifer, I see. Okay. Thank you, Calvin. There's a close up. Yes, sir. Pat's fan. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, if you guys got any questions, um, feel free to ask. Um, that's what we're here for. Remember, you guys, check your guys' kids' phones daily. You know, I know our kids don't like us checking their phones, but, you know, it's a good thing to be doing. You know, I'm games. You know, I'm a major gamer. You know, and I'm going to tell you firsthand, you know, as a gamer, you know, you've got gamers out there that seek female gamers. And I want to give uh, a shout, another shout out to Nate um, with uh, Trick Apparel. He is our sponsor. Um, give a shout out to him as he just came into the live feed um thanks nate for everything you guys do over there um you guys rock so <clears throat> check your kids's ps3s xbox ones xboxes whatever type of consoles are using it's another gateway But yeah, if anybody has any questions for us, uh, feel free, uh, feel free to ask us. It's you know, if it wasn't for you guys, we wouldn't be here because um, we need supporters. We need people backing us up. We can't do this all ourselves. You know, the more the better. You know, doing what others won't. That's what we're here for. You know. Yeah, you know, there's a lot of people that. So much. You know, we do this freely. You know, we don't get paid to do this. We do this out of our own time, out of our own day, on our own days off, during our work days. You know, this is something we're dedicated to doing, and that's what our organization is here for. Oh, yes, there's gamer, there's predators everywhere, especially the gaming consoles. No, Paula, um, I'm the founder uh, um, of the organization. I'm from Wisconsin. She's uh, six. My daughter is six years old. Thank you for the screenshot. I'll, I'll look it over. See, supporters like that, you know, that catches things on, on live feeds yeah. and, and stuff, that, that, that's good. You know, 
it, people like it that a lot tremendously. You know, it's hard to you know. Uh, yes, Bobby. True. Every, it's hard to catch every comment that somebody posts. Mm -hmm. So, especially when we're you know working and doing other things around the clock. We try to catch every comment, but it's hard for us to do. Hello, DD. Mm -hmm. Jinx, you owe me a soda, bro. <laughs> <laughs> so, <clears throat> if you guys see something that's not supposed to be on the page, feel free to message the page and, you know, help us out. Um, that That helps us out tremendously. Like I said, um, we're out for the awareness. We're out there to make everybody aware in their communities what's going on. Um, as we do have kids. as possible so what happened I feel like everything paused Nothing. for a second Do what you paused for a second I thought it did <laughs> talk about spamming the comments <laughs> yeah, that, that's my daughter. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> but yeah, if anybody has any more questions. Anything at all where I'm at, located, I'm here in Port Angeles, Washington. Give it up for our new hunter in Port Angeles, Washington, everyone. Give it up for him. You guys will be seeing him um, hopefully here shortly, probably. So anyone in the Washington area, Port Angeles area, uh, Olympic Peninsula, looking to build this team. Morning, Shorty. Morning, morning, morning. Bro, you're going to owe me a six-pack here soon, bro. St. Jose, California. St. Jose, California. Hey. He's reaching California, too, Mano. Do we have decoys in Washington? Morning, yes, we do. Go. Sacramento, yes, Paso Heights, Yuba City. Yes, we do have decoys in Minnesota, all over. Washington. We got decoys all over the place. Thank you, Bobby. Pretty good, Shorty. When are you guys doing a new bust? Uh, we might have a bust tonight, guys. Just to let you guys know. Um, if everything goes well, um, we should have a bust tonight. <clears throat> no, we do not have one in San Jose, Shorty. I am not currently residing in California anymore. I am in Port Angeles, Washington. Sorry for the appearance and the misinformation of my appearance. Uh, I am currently in Port Angeles, Washington. Uh, 
Mm. Brian thinks we will keep up the good work. We'll Thank keep you, the movement going. You want to say hi to everyone? Say hi. Tell everybody hi. Hello, everyone. All right. Now go. <laughs> How long have we been doing this? How long have we been doing this, Jay? Uh, we've been, this has been going on for two months. Uh, we've been up and running for two months now. You guys need to have something out there. Yeah, um, like I said, we we will we're we're getting each state slowly but surely. Um it, it's just we gotta find hunters in that area. We gotta That's, find people willing to dedicate their time and days, their days off to do this. You know, it's not uh one time thing. It's an everyday thing. You got to be fully dedicated, you know, to uh, open Stop the that, approach man. these predators, you know, with the intent to catch them on camera, on video, you know, you all stop that? maintaining safety, you know, knowing you're risking yourself, you know, to catch these guys on video, you know, so. Building these teams in these cities and states, you know, it's a hard thing to find these people wanting to dedicate their time out of their day to do this, you know. So we are trying our best to build teams, you know, in all these states and all these cities. You know, it's up to us to be willing to be open to dedicating ourselves to do it. I am from Wisconsin, D.D., How many dirtbags have you exposed to date? I have exposed five, Joseph. <clears throat> How many states do you have so far? We have Minnesota. We have uh, Florida. We have um, Washington, and that's it, in Wisconsin. Oh, and Illinois. I forgot Illinois. We just got a hunter in Illinois, and we just got a, a hunter in Michigan. So... So, so yeah, we're, we're getting, we're getting there guys. Um, we still need a hunter in, we still need a hunter in, uh, a lot more states. And you're right, Paula, being a decoy is not easy. I'm not a decoy. I've never been wanting to do decoy because I've, I deal with, with decoys. I see what they have to go through. Being a decoy is hard. You have to talk to these sick individuals and pretend that you're a 15-year-old. It's very hard to uh, maintain composure and not be sick about it and to continue until you finally meet them or get them to meet, you know. Yeah, it is a tough job, and I give it up for them decoys that do the job. You know, I honestly can tell you, everyone, I could never maintain my composure if I was a decoy. Yes, our decoys do go through a lot. Our decoys go through a lot of stuff. They see a lot of things. Thank you. So. Hey, Kimberly. You know, we, we 
we get a lot of people, you know, wanting to see the chat logs, wants us to post the chat logs. No, you do not. You know, we don't. Same state to be a decoy. You know, we, we don't, we don't want to post chat logs of what these guys or girls are saying to these kids. Um, that is evidence. That is, you know, evidence against the predator. Um, if we posted what the chat logs say, then there wouldn't be no case. Welcome, Kim. Here, join the party. Hey, how, how do I, uh, Hey, Jay, how do you do this? Uh, so what? This, this is my first time. Uh, what did you do? Oh. You know, leave it there. You only can have one person up at a time. Oh, okay. You can't. You If you want to bring somebody else up, I have to drop out, and you can bring somebody else up. Oh, okay. And I'll see you. Learn something new every day. If I didn't know, now I know. And knowing's half the battle. Like I said, guys, um, what we do is very risky. It's very risky. Um, we have to make sure that all of our ducks are in a row. Because if not, then we don't. We won't have a conviction for one, for two. Um, it, it it just messes up with the case that we have if we post any any chat logs. Robin, we would get the chat logs from you. You have to send them to us in, in a chat room. Uh, yeah. Basically, you know, we have a team. We have a chat room on Facebook Messenger. And what we do, we as a team collaborate together and when when our decoy has like say a, we have a decoy in minnesota and they got a pervert from wisconsin a predator from wisconsin okay that decoy sends all the chat logs to the hunter so then the hunter has all the chat logs they read over everything. They go and meet the predator. Okay. Once they meet the predator, <clears throat> the decoy, it doesn't matter if it's from a different state, the decoy, if the police officer lets it happen, the decoy emails all the chat logs and all the evidence to the police officer's email. But sometimes you get police officers that don't want you to email it to them. They seize your phone. They take your phone from you for evidence. So that means we're without a phone until the case is all done. That is why we ask, that is why we ask for phones, tablets, because the police confiscates our phones sometimes. Yes, and affording phones is not easy. You know, uh, we're always having to keep up and maintain with several phones at once, including the ones I'm using. So, uh, when the police officers request your phone or our phones, you know, we have to give up our phones. doesn't matter what it is or what's on it, you know, for evidence. So asking for donations for tablets and phones really helps, you know, uh, because we're left without a phone, you know, until the case is over. They're talking about your tag on your hat. Did you forget your tag? No, I did not forget my tag. It's a California thing. People in California that are watching this, they know.
Yeah, I know. I should be sleeping. But I kind of fell asleep on Jay yesterday after telling him I was going to do this video. So, to man up, I woke up early to do it. No, we don't do that in California. <laughs> yes, we do. <laughs> no, man. <laughs> You're lucky you're still not on my shoes. Just in case you want to return it or something, they uh, they said. No, it's a <laughs> it's a freshness thing. You know, you see a fresh hat with a brand new tag. You know, it kind of tells a little bit about the individual. You know. They're saying, are you in Cali? No, I am are not you a Cali hunter? Sorry for the misrepresentation. I am originally from Yuba City, California, Del Paso Heights, Sacramento, California. But I live in Port Angeles, Washington right now. Yes, I do have. I got four kids. Yes, I have four kids. What I'm part of Cali are you from? California. Most of all my family is in Del Paso Heights, California. They don't do it in San Diego, she said. Yeah, Northern <clears throat> California. Yeah, you can tell. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> you guys are funny. <laughs> oh, that is that. That was funny. I have to read that one. So I could look cool walking around the store in Cali wearing their hat and then oh, just so dark. I'd be a little rag right now, Heather. Thank you. So, again, for everyone that missed it, you know, uh, I'm in Port Angeles, Washington, trying to build a team here in Washington. I'm going to be the new head guy here in Washington. Yes, everybody gets background checked. Everybody on the team, anybody that comes on my team is background. We, we... We do it just like you would do a job. We run a background check, make sure that you ain't wanted, make sure that you ain't got no, uh, what'd you do? Go get you some more. I'm about, to, <laughs> I'm about to get some more real quick. Give me one second, guys. So, yeah. Oh. Ah, I had to grab my pup outside. Ah, grab my puppy. Look, look at his puppies are out. I have 11. How many puppies you have? 11. Not two. 11. I have 11 dogs. They're my children. <laughs> I 
I actually have six girls. They're all right here. And I got five boys in the back. They're Dotsons. Chewini. Another thing, if you guys would like to become a sponsor to our organization, feel free to, uh, you know, message the page and we'll talk about a sponsorship if you're looking to sponsor. Um, <clears throat> we've already got one sponsor, Trick Apparel. So give a shout out to them. <clears throat> Trick Apparel, guys. Make sure you guys go look them up on Facebook. <laughs> Try to go through these comments as they're going through. I forgot you can respond right. to them. I will, I'm gonna I'm gonna get off of this live and I'm gonna let you uh, talk more to them and uh, get to knowing the supporters. All right, all right, guys. You guys have a great day. Um, like I said, uh, stay tuned. Make sure that you guys got your notifications on. Um, we have some potential busts for later tonight and tomorrow if these guys come through. So um, thank you all for your support. And I'm going to give it back over to Jose. All right, guys, how we doing? Yeah, um, apparently I'm here in Port Angeles, Washington, hoping to build this team. I'm hoping to be a bigger part of I'm dedicating my free time out of my day to do this. Uh, I don't ask to get paid to do this. We don't get paid to do this. We do this freely uh, on our days off. Even during our work days, we're here still working. Uh... Hold up, I'm trying to find some comments. Don't forget to check that message. So, as my feed is going through here, we are currently linked up to our to my chat room. And our chat room goes through a lot of messages daily, and our phones burn up super fast. So, you know, uh, right now my phone just went from 50% to 15 in the past half hour. Oh, yes. You want to see my puppies? Hey, Dolo, Mira Golon. Hey, those are my dogs. My babies and children. They're more spoiled than I am. So anything helps you guys, you know, uh, sharing our posts, sharing our videos, you know, uh, getting our name out there, you know, talking about us, you know, uh, we're here for you guys, you know, we're here to do what others won't. Thank you, Lynn. Thank you, Paula. Hey, Kim, you still here? You want, you want to come on in? You want to tell them about decoys?
Hi, Jose. <laughs> hey, Kim. How we doing? I'm good. How are you? I'm great. Hey, everyone. This is Kimberly, one of the head <laughs> decoys. This well, is one of the but I'm, well, one of the I was the co-founder of uh, Jay's group and everything. was with him for almost two months, but I'm currently now with the Pennsylvania um, uh, hunter group over there. So, sure, but no, we're all in. Decoy. Yeah, with the yep so but you know we're all in it for the same reason we have the same mo you know motive behind it and you know to be there and support each other is what we need so it don't matter what group you know well I'll tell them a little bit how how you know how to be a decoy or how hard it is to be a decoy uh, we had some questions earlier on um, what it takes to be a decoy and is it hard? Well, basically to be a decoy, you have to have a lot of time. I mean, a lot. we get a lot of people that comes in wanting to be a decoy and they try it. Hey, Josh. Um, but, I mean, then they're really not active or they don't have to, t you know, the time to do it. Um, you just got to have a lot of time. I mean, it's basically like, I always tell people it's like a full-time job, basically. Um, whether it's daytime, you can do it, or nighttime, but it takes a lot of hours. And if you don't have a lot of hours to put in it every day, then it's not really for you. Um, you have to be able to talk to these sickos. You got to have a strong stomach. Um it's bad. <laughs> I mean, it's really bad. So, um, if, you know, if you guys want to be a part of Jay's team, you know, worldwide message their page. Um, Jose is trying to start, you know, his own chapter in Washington, you know, just if you're interested in working with them, message their page. Um, and someone will get back to you. Um, just make sure you have plenty of time to put in to be a decoy. Or if you're wanting, you know, to be a hunter as well, just message the page and someone over there will get back to you. Thank you, Kimberly. Appreciate the support and the sharing of what it takes to be a decoy. You know, and this is Kimberly from Pennsylvania Predator Hunters. You know, yes. uh, uh, she is uh, one of the best. You know, so for people in Pennsylvania, you know, look out for this one. <laughs> Thank you, Jose. <laughs> All right. So, All right. Talk uh, to you later. later. So, good to see you guys. It's good to be a part of this team. Thank you for all the comments and the support, everyone. You know, hopefully I could get my, net, my first bust here real soon. So, all right, Jose. You guys have a good one. Bye.